Hello viewers, it's K Felix here and I welcome you to my YouTube channel K Felix Inspire. I would like to say a very big thank you to all of you for the support and the contribution you are giving to this channel. If you are new to this channel, please do not forget to subscribe and also you turn on the bell icon so that you get notified whenever I post new videos. Well, as you can see in these pictures, this is a former Home Affairs Minister in the PF government, that is Mr. Stephen Campiongo, uh, giving a reaction to the speech which was earlier given today by His Excellency the President of, of the Republic of Zambia, Mr. Hakahinde Ichilema, when he opened Parliament today. Quality education and free education are two different aspects. So we would have loved him to um, see how he could have stuck to his promise to the Zambian learners and the parents. All of us parents who are sending children to school, we know the realities uh, uh, the ch about the challenges of offering free education. But he was very clear in his campaign messages. But today uh, we, we were treated to a lecture. Uh, Quality education, when we spoke about free education, the president insisted that he was using English, the Prince language. So I hope our learners have uh, uh, picked the message regarding that. Farming, we are rural MPs who represent poor farmers. Poor farmers who have been expecting um, to start accessing fertilizer 250 batch of paper. But again, we are yet to see. Uh, what will be in the budget as the minister comes because uh, the president was only speaking to lowering the cost of inputs. These are things that we have spoken to. If you look at the PF manifesto, these are things that we are speaking to and uh, we have been quite clear in terms of how we wanted to inform the agriculture sector. So I think there's need for clarity so that people can have uh, clear information on what it is that the European government is going to do uh, in the education sector, especially which has been realigned. But the free education aspect must be made clear to our parents and to our learners. Then Honorable, I want to find out um, what assurance do you have to the people of Zambia in terms of providing uh, uh, credible checks and balances to this uh, government? That's what we are going to do. I mean, we, um, we are the, the, the past government, now we are in the opposition. We are elected by the people of Zambia to ensure that uh, we hold the current government accountable and we also make sure that they don't fear off from their promises and that's very key that's what i'm saying we expected the president to unpack how the implementation of the education sector premised on free education access to free quality education from primary to tertiary education that's a promise that that has been on the table so we wanted the president to unpack 